Right, guys, this is Street Fighter 5. This is the arcade version. If, if you haven't got Street Fighter 5, send me an email and I'll point you in the right direction. Right, so when you first get Street Fighter downloaded, extract it and you'll end up with this folder. Mm. Pardon me. And you don't want this one. You want to go into Street Fighter V. Into binaries. Win 64. Right here you can change your controls. So all you got to do is double click on each one. Then hit a button on your controller. I've already set it up as an Xbox 360 controller. So you shouldn't have to change anything unless you want to add two players, three players. I haven't tried it with four players. I I've only tried it with two players, so that works fine. So once you've done that, don't worry about this. This will not work at all. Any resolution won't work. So it doesn't matter what you put there. I'll, I'll show you now how to change the resolution of the game. I put reshade on as well because I like um, global illumination but it runs a bit slow at 4k so I'll show you how to change the resolution so once you've finished if you need to change anything you just click OK OK then exit so guys the only way to change your resolution I want to drop mine because I've been playing it at 4k at 60 frames per second but I want to add global illumination so I'm going to drop it down to 1440p so where your exe is right click your mouse and go to send to desktop create shortcut so now you have your shortcut here I have to zoom in when I edit the video and right click on your EXE go down to properties and where you've got your target here if you go to the end where the exclamation mark is press space then I'll leave this in the description so you can just highlight what you want go to copy which is right click copy and, and then just paste it in here and now this will force the game to run at this resolution then you click apply then OK you've got to start on the shortcut as it adds the resolution to the game So I'm going to add my, I'll show you a before and after actually, so you can see the game plan before and after reshade. Wherever it is, let's go right at the bottom. Fighter 
Arcade. And if I bring up Reshade, you should be able to see. in there. Have a good display depth. What oh, is there? There you go, you see the lighting channel now. See the, the, where the actual light's gonna bounce to. Turn the after off now. USA. Round one. He's gonna be quite hard, Dial, so he's not doing a lot. What are you doing, man? Normally, why you pick? Um, go put up a decent fight, but. 
Keep your distance. Come on, man. Fuck it. Turn up difficulty on the round two. Point. Test menu. One way to I didn't realize you had that one there. Yeah. There's one way to kick straight up and one that you could punch straight up. I found the punch straight up, but not the kick straight up. <coughs> that probably doesn't make any sense to anyone. Not for me. <laughs> yeah. I like Vega as a character, he's a good character. Especially where you can like a jumped up walls comes down and picks people Round up. One. That's quite cool. Fight. Oh, yeah, yeah, oh, 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 y
I'm not gonna give me triggers. And the PT guys can just hold down two buttons, but. Oh! You bastard! Jimmy Triggers. Jim. Oh, I died it. You lose. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Cheers.